Hello friends, this is Neha and once again I welcome you all to my YouTube channel about technology. In this video tutorial, we will discuss about two familiar terms in networking, that is Internet and Ethernet. Well, both of these are communication standards that enable connectivity between two communicating devices. If we talk about Internet, it is a network of network that gradually form a wide area network. However, Ethernet is a hardwired connection between the computers that gradually form a local area network. Discussing both of these terms in detail, we will also identify differences between them. So without further delay, let's get started. We all know that internet is a global network that connect million of computers all across the world. It facilitates user to communicate with each other. Whenever you connect your device to internet, it means you're going online. The internet enable you to send emails, videos, photos, audios, etc. Even you can access web applications, cloud data, social media apps and many other similar services. We all use internet for watching videos, ordering food, online courses, online shopping, sharing GPS location, etc. In short, it has become a prominent resource for users across the world to exchange information. For establishing communication between two devices, we may require dozens of computers that fall in the path between these two. Now, how do we connect these computers? Well, we have two techniques for connecting computer in network, that is, wired connection and wireless connection. Now, connecting all computers to internet using wired connection will complicate things. For suppose here we have 8 computers. If you want that each computer must be connected to other using wired connection, then for each computer we require 7 cable, which is a lot. So, to avoid these complications, we came up with router and modem. Router is one that route messages on a correct path to which it was destined. However, router can connect up to 10 computers only. But when we talk of internet, there are millions of computers. So to make a huge network, we connect router to other routers to make infinite connections for infinite computers. Now to carry data, we require a medium. So we use telephone lines to carry data. But they accept analog signals only, while a computer generates digital signal. So we require a device modem that convert analog signal to digital signal and vice versa. So this is how router and modem play a vital role in connecting devices to internet. The service of connecting you to internet is maintained by ISPs, that is, internet service providers. These ISPs connect routers to each other to form a huge network that we refer as internet. Now let us discuss how internet brings you your requested data. For suppose you want to open a website that is stored on a server which is present at a data center somewhere in the world. Now, this data center must be somehow connected to internet service provider that also provides internet connection to you. To reach this data center, your computer will first concern a DNS that will convert your requested URL to its corresponding IP address. Once your computer gets the IP address, it can easily connect to particular server where your requested data is stored and retrieve the requested data. So, knowing much about internet, let us learn about Ethernet. Ethernet is a technology that allows you to create local network using wired channel. It is a conventional method to connect devices in a local area network. Or it is also helpful in connecting devices in a wide area network. The Ethernet has evolved over years for the digital age. It is popular because of its low cost ability to evolve and deliver performance while maintaining the compatibility with the devices that has also evolved over the years. Earlier, the Ethernet would provide speed of 10 megabits per second, which has gradually increased to 400 gigabytes per second as of now. Knowing much about what is Internet and what is Ethernet, let us discuss about differences between them. If we talk about Internet, it is a global network where connected computers use TCPA protocol to communicate with each other. However, in Ethernet, the computers are connected with each other using Ethernet cable to form a local area network. If we compare Internet and Ethernet based on size, then Internet is bigger than Ethernet. The Internet is worldwide network that connect computer across the world, whereas Ethernet connect computer in a LAN using hardwired medium. Internet is comparatively less secure as anyone can gain access to the network to retrieve information. On the other hand, Ethernet is more secure because no outer device can access the local area network. 
The internet uses point-to-point -point network to implement communication between computers connected to internet, whereas Ethernet uses broadcast network to implement communication. Internet allows multiple communication at the same time as here communication takes place concurrently among different parts of network. However, in Ethernet, it allows only one communication at a time. WAN is an example of internet that connects computers worldwide, while computers connected to LAN using Ethernet cable are example of Ethernet. So this is all about internet and Ethernet and the differences between these two terms. For more details, you can refer our official website techdifferences.com. I had given URL for the same in the description below. Please like and share this video with your friends and family and don't forget to subscribe our YouTube channel about technology. Keep checking the channel for further updates and put your comment and queries in the section below. We'll be back again soon with a new video. Till then, take a good care of yourself.